Anyway, guys, um, let's move on to the next topic, the last topic for today. Um, hi. Whether you love him, whether you hate him, whether you are jealous, whether you are, you know, whether you are looking at it uh, from a place where people are benefiting, whether you say any of these things, you cannot escape that what Rulani's Sundowns is doing is incredible. It's incredible. Rulani, Rulani got appointed October 2022. He got appointed to October 2022 when he became the full uh, head coach alone. Ever since then, Mamadouli Sundowns have gone 40 games unbeaten in the league. 40 games without a defeat. Chiefs' record was 32 or 33. Rulan is taking it to 40. They're 10 games away from being invincible. That is insane. When Pizzo left and he said that he's going to be uh, better than Upizzo, it's, yo. Oh. Right now, he's got 100 points in the league. 100. He got 48 points last season. And then he got 52. He's on 52 this, this season. Since he took over. 100 points. No losses in that time. Guys. I know. I know. A lot of us are going to default and say. Ah it's easy to do it with Mamelodi Sundowns. Ah it's easy to do it because you are this or you are that. It's easy because you are spending money. It's easy. You still have to coach. To go 40 games. Without even a lucky win. Just the lucky, just, you know, we were having a bad day and uh, uh, somebody handballed it into, into the bottom of the net. And we lost. That is incredible. And I'm urging you guys, please, 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 let's take off the hater hats. Let's take off the, 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 or the questioning hats and all of that stuff. It's a great record. It is an incredible record. Nelaki. Guys, Man City loses Kalaki. They go to Brentford. Brentford scores one goal out of the blue. They win the game. 40 games. 4-0. Four 4-0. Zero. Four zero. And I'd also like to say, to give him credit as well, to give him credit, do you guys realize that while coaching at Sundowns might be the most perfect jobs, most perfect job that you could ask for, most probably in the PSL, the most perfect job, there's pressure. There's pressure. Rolani knows that he could win the league, walk the league, do badly in the Champions League and he could be out. Rolani knows that when you spend that much money getting players and you've got that much quality, there's a pressure that hangs on your head because these guys are so good. Imagine I get you the top of the line everything. Part of my expectations of you is I've done my job. As, as, as the people in the back, we've done our job. We've given you the resources. We've backed you. Now the pressure is on you to make it work. And we've seen plenty of teams die. Plenty of coaches drown under that pressure. So I think it's only right we give him credit. It's only right. As fans of football, guys. As fans of football. Here's a new record standing in front of us. And it's easy for me to be... Uh, it's, it's easy for me to be bitter. It's easy for me to be bitter. Right, it's easy. He's broken my team's records. But give him credit. And I see, I'm looking at a comment here. He doesn't do these things on his own. That's, part, that's what I'm saying. When you come in as a coach of Sundowns, the machine is behind you. And remember that you are a replaceable cog within the machine. 
He said it himself. He's the least important person. But also, if something goes wrong, he's the first head to roll. Umanoba had the same. He had the same machine behind him when he was demoted and made, or not de you guys don't like to say demoted, but he was taken away from being a, a, a co-head coach and he was made into uh, the, the, the first team coach under Urulani on the hierarchy. Whose head rolled? It wasn't the technical directors, it wasn't Rulani, it wasn't anybody. It was on his head. And let's be fair to him too. Let's be fair to him too. He's changed a lot of things. This is not the same Sundowns that played when he took over 22. In, 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 in 2022. It's different players. It's a different system. You know, it's, it's a lot of things are different. And it's not all him, but give him the credit, guys. Can we please, guys? Can we please just celebrate? As we speak so much about bad things every day um, on these shows of ours on social media. Every day we talk about uh, coaches doing this wrong, coaches doing that wrong. Can we celebrate these guys and put aside our, our tribalism? Because also, the greatest thing about this is that he's relatively young as a coach and he's South African. He's one of us. He's at the helm of one of the best teams in, the, in, the, in Africa. He's one of us. He's on Instagram. He does all of these things. It's not uh, all the coaches and the guys we always see. And not to take anything away from them, guys. I don't want to take anything away from them. But this only helps us in future. This maybe even makes it possible when we think about South African coaches and we say we want coaches to aspire to something. Here's an example. So I just wanted to take the last few uh, minutes of the show to honestly just say kudos to Rulani, Coach Mukwena. Kudos. Uh, kudos to Imamala de Sundowns. Um, what they're doing is incredible. Honestly, what they're doing is incredible. The fact that they've been able to keep the standard up for this long and improve on it year on year on year is incredible and I will always say I am jealous of sundowns but I'm not jealous of sundowns because I want or I don't want my jealousy to lead me to saying we must pull sundowns down in order for them to you know come back down to earth that's the way we want to win this I'm jealous because I would love my team to have such lofty goals to have such lofty aspirations to put uh, resources behind it and chase them. I was so disheartened by U -U 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 Bab Keza. When Bab Keza said, uh, essentially, they're waiting for Sundowns to trip and fall on their own. I mean, Liverpool took 30 years to get their, their, their league. It happens. Bayern Munich always wins their leagues. But I think Sundowns is showing us that there's there's a there's a there's when you take your team seriously, the results come. So bigger than Rulani, well done to Mavalu Sundowns, the people in the back, uh, the the technical directors, the academy directors, the way they've structured all of that, guys. So that's why I just want to I just want to say that just can we put away those things even if it's just for a moment even if just for a moment it's an incredible record and um, let's see if it, it if it continues how long it will continue um, but on the same token let's hope that the other teams are working hard enough to try stop it.